109 outside. So it's always filming it, but check it out. Tesla deleted the videos. California, 109 outside. Mom seen here goes to charge her Tesla and it locks. Inside the car is her infant baby. This is her swinging, trying to break the window to get to her baby. There was a group of people who were helping her. It took them six, seven minutes to get into the car. The baby was completely drenched with sweat and she was frantic. She talked to Tesla and initially they said it was probably a software issue that locked your car. And then they dug further and said it wasn't a software issue. But the interesting fact is that when she took it to get serviced at Tesla, out of all the video the car recorded, this is actual footage from the car. The car recorded her pounding on the car trying to get in. They deleted this footage. And when she said, why did you delete that footage? The Tesla service reps didn't say anything. This is just another example of now, like we talked about before, they're going to start using police body cam. Police are no longer going to write reports. They're just going to dock it, and then AI is going to write the reports. Oh, they're just going to delete here and there. And it's like, what are you talking about? There's no transcripts of anything. And anytime you try to have evidence against them, because AI is available to the public, that's why they're never going to take it away from the public. They're going to say, you used AI. You created this. We didn't fake anything. You are fake. Oh. The Chinese, is this a good idea? The robot is powered by lab-grown human brain cells. The Chinese researchers who developed the brain-on-chip technology, called MetaBOC, let Shanghai Eye in its lab to capture this footage. Researchers from Tianjin University and Southern University of Science and Technology say their tiny lab-grown brain, or brain organoid, could learn tasks faster than current AI models. They say it uses much less energy than AI, which needs a lot of power and data to learn. These brain cells also show more intuition and creativity than AI, learning with fewer examples. The researchers believe this technology could combine human-like and machine intelligence. This would mean robots and other machines could think and learn more like humans. The goal is to create smarter robots that learn and adapt on their own. So, is this... And Tesla's... China is all in on humanoid robotics and has announced some insane developments in the last 48 hours. AGI Bot, a China-based robotics startup, just unveiled a family of five advanced humanoid robots directly challenging Elon Musk and Tesla's upcoming Optimus Bot. Unitree showcased its new G1 humanoid robot, which is nearing mass production and comes at a price tag of only $16,000. This thing has insane whole body control. Another Chinese company, Astrobot, revealed Astrobot S1. The the two-wheel robot demo showed the humanoid doing human tasks in real time with no teleoperation. Impressively smooth based on the demo video. Now back to AGI Bot. These five new models are both wheeled and biped humanoid robots specifically designed for diverse tasks, from household chores to industrial operations. The flagship model, Yuanjing A2, stands 5 feet 9 inches, weighs 121 pounds, and can perform delicate tasks like needle threading. The company aims to start shipping 300 units by the end of 2024, claiming better commercialization and cost control abilities than Tesla. The robotics and AI race between the US and China is intensifying. While it's been months since Tesla unveiled its Optimus 2 prototype, these three Chinese startups have showcased major technical progress in just a few days.